Hi, I'm Angelica from Wright Brothers and today I'll be showing you how to shuck an oyster from home. Um, so all you need is a chopping board, a tea towel, an oyster knife. If you haven't already got an oyster knife, you can buy them online. Or you can also pop down to our seafood counter at Borough Market, Thursday to Saturday, um, and your oyster. Okay, let's get started. So just a few tips before we get shucking. Once you receive your oysters, there's no need to submerge them to water or to freeze them. You can just pop them into the fridge as the ideal temperature is around three to five degrees. Just make sure that when you're storing them, they are the right way up, so flat lid on top. Um, and we recommend that you consume them within five days of delivery. Okay, so now we can get down with the shucking. So grab your oyster out of the box and then what you wanna do is put it in the middle of your tea towel and then with your loose end of your tea towel, you just fold it over the top so that will protect your hand. And then with your free hand, just put a bit of pressure on the oyster to keep it steady. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna break the hinge. The hinge is this bit here, it's the bit that connects the flat top um, to the oyster shell. And then the aim is to get the tip of the oyster knife in far enough to break it, but not too far that you stab the oyster. So what I like to do is just to find the entry point and then put the tip of the knife inside and then apply a bit of pressure. Now, a good indicator of um, if you've applied enough pressure is if your oyster can hang off the knife, that should be more than enough to break the hinge. And then you just twist your wrist. So I like to twist away from myself and then you should hear the hinge pop like that. And then pry the top of the shell open, wipe your knife down so you don't get any oyster shell in the actual oyster. And then what you, we wanna do now is release the flat bit of the oyster shell away from the abductor muscle, which is round about here. So use the tip of the knife to kind of lift it up. And then with the sharp edge of your knife, run it along the top of the flat shell like this, and then shimmy your knife down. There you go. And that will release the lid. And then now you've got your oyster. And then all you have to do is put the tip of the knife again underneath the oyster itself and cut the bottom of the oyster abductor muscle away and then it's ready to eat. Ta-da!